What's up, what's up? It's your girl, Cindy Goodman, and if you didn't know, now you know. Uh, so it's not Monday, it's actually Tuesday. I forgot to vlog on Monday because I thought it was Sunday because in the United States, we had Monday off, it was President's Day. Um, but yeah, I don't know, I'm sitting in the car, I'm about to walk into my last therapy session with my therapist. I have been seeing her for almost two years and she is retiring from seeing clients. So I had to find a new therapist and I finally did. It was a journey because my current therapist told me, um, a couple months ago that she was going to be retiring. And so I've been through the process of like screening people and trying to find people who take my insurance and have open times. Finally found someone. She's really awesome. Uh, so that's good, but it just feels weird. Um, I feel like yeah, I don't know. It feels like I'm breaking up with somebody, which is weird. Um, I'm feeling really overwhelmed going into this week. I'm not sure if it's the shortened work week and then I'm traveling to San Francisco tomorrow evening and staying there through Thursday evening. And I just feel like I have a lot going on. Like it feels like my head is just like, oh, and spinning around. And this dumb thing is I should probably meditate to help relieve that pressure. But instead, I'm just like, no, I don't have time. I just want to sit here. Um, but I was proud of myself last night. Alex went to a like Mario party competition thing and I was supposed to go with him. And while I don't like bailing, um, I ultimately made the decision that it would be best to start my week off cause he wasn't going to get home until like midnight. And that's really late for me and decided not to go and just stayed at home and chilled. I watched sorry to bother you for the first time. And wow, that movie was not what I was expecting. Even though everybody told me that movie's not what you expect it to be. I thought it laid it on a little thick uh, with the social commentary, which I'm all for social commentary, like that's art, that's film, but um, it felt a little too in your face, I guess. I don't know. I, maybe I just wasn't in the mood for, wow, what the, what's going on there? I shouldn't touch it. Oops. Poop. Pretend I didn't touch it. Um, and then the end is the third act. You're just like, what? Um, but I loved how surreal it was and I thought it, the style of it was really fun. I really liked the lead. I thought he did a great job in it. Um, made me want to start watching Atlanta again. It was just so hard for me to watch Atlanta because I didn't have FX and I'd have to buy each episode on iTunes. I'm like, oh, that's not going to happen. Um, what else? It's kind of it. I just, I feel burnt out, like burnt out on like video games. I don't really want to play any games right now. I've only been playing League of Legends. Um, and just like everything feels like it's taking a trillion times the amount of effort than it usually does, but I'm tracking through. Um, I might be in like a little bit of like a depression. I'm not sure. I don't totally feel it outside of just like that motivation thing, but I'm giving you an extra long Tuesday vlog since I didn't vlog on Monday and then I'll see you all tomorrow. <laughs> Hey guys, so I'm in San Francisco. It is Wednesday, just flew in, and look who is laughing at me. Oh my gosh, no, I haven't flipped the camera yet, but look who's here. <laughs> it's James. Uh, look, do you know who James is? No, you don't. Here, James, tell everybody. Some of y'all know, know me. <laughs> tell, tell them what? Tell them how we know each other. Um, Sydney and I actually met on a blind date. Um, <laughs> it was in the true. desert in Africa back when she thought she was black, and. What? You know, we just had a great time, and then Instant connection. I learned that she was racist. And, so. <laughs> this isn't true. This is going on the internet, James. People we are thought, gonna believe you. Not against blacks. <laughs> so it's fine. We've <laughs> <laughs> been friends ever since. None of this is true. <laughs> Most of it's true. Wait, what was your first impression of me? You're a darn whore. No, that's also not. That is not true. You can't be putting me on the internet like this. I'm not prepared. I didn't. Wait, no, but okay. What was your first impression of me? Um, pretty, rich, Asian. I don't. <laughs> you know, it's Asian. That's so nice. Speaking of Asian, we're at a Filipino restaurant that serves vegetarian Filipino food. Check this out. We have some pancit. We have some lumpia. We have some chicken adobo, and we have some garlic rice. You probably can't hear me, but. Okay, say bye, James. Hey guys, I just landed in LAX and I'm waiting to be picked up, so I thought it'd be a good time to vlog. Look, I'm getting a zit on my forehead. I'm also standing next to an automatic door, so there's a good chance you can't hear anything I'm saying. I'm saying, um, yeah, I was in San Francisco for the day. Unfortunately, I didn't get to do the daily fix, but I did get to do a really fun for honor stream. I also shot some things with, or something, with Steven and Andreas and like, 
you guys. I just love the folks up there. Like, I wish I could work with them more. I seriously can't even speak to how much I love, like, that crew up there. They're so awesome. Cue this picture of me, Steven, Andreas, Flex, Alexio, <laughs> and Mitch. They're so great. Like, what the heck? So fun. Uh, yeah, and then I got on the... I feel awful. Like, I feel straight up bad. I have no idea why. I feel like something just attacked me, my immune system, while I was on the plane. I've been so good about, like, using hand sanitizer and washing my hands and drinking enough water. And I, I feel bad, like, definitively bad, which sucks. Um, but that's okay, because at least I had fun being up there. Um a busy weekend too but look okay so my face is breaking out i think it's because i am using i'm on like a week and a half of using the stuff from my dermatologist and it's doing a good job cleaning up my chin and i'm using it on my full face and i feel like it's pulling breakouts out that have just kind of been hiding uh, which is exciting but also just like wow what's happening my face this makes me wish that i didn't have to be on camera all day um and i recognize it's not that bad i think it's just like this one particularly kind of hurts. Anyways, gonna peace out, but happy Thursday. Hi, my hair obviously looks different. I just changed it like literally an hour ago. Um, it was pretty impulsive actually. I feel like I never wanted to admit necessarily that I didn't love my hair. Like I liked it and when I first got it done, I was shocked and was like, maybe I'm just not used to it. And then I got it done again and it went more of like a silvery type blonde and I really, really loved it. And then after about like three weeks of that, I was like, mm, I miss my hair. So I didn't go quite as dark as my natural hair, but I did go kind of ish dark. Um, but yeah, I'm happy with it. It's a nice change. I'm happy to have to be back. I have so many zits. Uh, that whole dermatologist, it'll get worse before it gets better. There's too much truth to that. Um, let's see. I'm about to vlog, or well, I'm about to do my video that's going to come out on Saturday. So it would have come out on the previous Saturday about my mental health journey. And I'm like oddly very nervous for it. Or I actually, I was really nervous about it. And now I feel like I'm not as nervous as I should be. But like, why should I be nervous? Um, so if you haven't watched that, it sounds interesting go watch it. I don't know. This is so weird. I don't know if, are you guys used to this? I'm not. That's crazy. Wow. Anyways, I'm so burnt out from this week. This was like such a high stress week for me. And I'm proud that I'm like listening to my body and I'm like, Hey Sid, you should rest because I have a busy week and my aunt's moving. And so we're doing like a bye lunch tomorrow. And then, um, it's my friend Billy's birthday on Saturday night. And then on Sunday I'm doing a Halo tournament. Uh, so busy weekend and I don't know I'm just I'm proud that I am honoring my body in my mind even though I feel like a, I have another part of me that's like this is so irresponsible like you should just suck it up you should stream like that's important which it is important but I think that like I'm understanding my limits which is good I am at South Coast Plaza which is in Orange County and I'm waiting for my doubles partner to show up. Uh, we are entering a Halo 3 doubles tournament at the Microsoft Store. Uh, if you remember correctly, um, I did enter a doubles tournament, but it was Halo 5 back in September and it didn't go super well. Uh, but Teddy and I, we decided we were gonna do this about a month ago, so we've had a few rounds of practice. I still have to say I don't really like doubles very much. I very much prefer 4v4. And um, to be honest, I am kind of trash at Halo 3. I'm pretty sure I was way better at it when it was going on, but getting back into it has been very, very difficult. So can't say if this will go much better than last time. So I'm at work, which obviously means it's Monday, not Sunday or the weekend or whenever the last time I vlogged. I, oh my gosh, just taking a week off because I did the Q&A video last week has messed me up so 
much. But the final thing I wanted to say for this week is I just want to thank everyone for the insane amount of support on my mental health video. I was so nervous to put it out because I was afraid that like I wouldn't be saying the right things or my experience like wasn't valid as something to talk about or that like people would just think it's stupid. But the amount of you who have come out and said like, Sid, I support you or said how it helps you or just like, knowing that other people are experiencing these problems is a good thing. I just want to say thanks for letting me know because I really appreciate it. Uh, yeah, so it's Monday and I will be doing an actual Monday vlog for next week's vlog later. But um, yeah, so if you enjoyed this, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and turn on notifications so you're the first to know when a new video drops and I'll see everyone on a stream or our next video.